Good morning everyone this is Govarshini I am from the department of biomedical and I am presenting my topic for the course digital principles and system designing my topic is all about digital principle and the logic gates used in Arduino introducing the topic Arduino board designs use a variety of microprocessors and microcontrollers the board are equipped with sets of digital analog input and output pins that may be interfaced to various expansion boards or breadboards Digital principles in the Arduinos include Arduino is a open source platform that is used for construction and programming of electronics it receives and send information to the other devices and it also receives and send information through the in- internet to command a specific electronic device it uses a hardware called Arduino Uno circuit boards and software program the logic gates that are used in arduino are the basic logic gate that is called as the basic gate is defined asa component with one or more inputs and one output the inputs and outputs are all digital there are three fundamental gates and total seven gates there are seven logic gates that are majorly used for Arduino that is AND, OR, NOR, NAND and XNOR, NOT gate and XOR gate. These are the logic gates that are being used in Arduinos. Arduinos digital input and digital output. The digital input means when we are supplying high and low voltages to the Arduino, to the Arduino board. On the contrary, digital output means when we are taking high or low voltage from the Arduino. It is all about it. Uh, the input, digital input and output are contrary. That how much input we are giving and what is the output that we are getting from the Arduino. The chips are majorly three Arduino chips. The chips are B port, C port and D port. B port is the chip which include pin 8 to 13 and C port include analog input pins and D port include digital pins 0 to 7. The major working of Arduino is Arduino gives result to the input that we are giving. So depending on the input signal that it receives, the Arduino microcontroller redirects the robot or the device to move in an alternate direction by approximately accurating the motor interface interfaced to it through a motor driver IC. When all the necessary components are getting together, a robot car or the electronic process that what we have to do in that particular device will be activated. The uses of Arduinos are Arduino is a microcontroller. It is a very small computer that is used as the brain of the robot or brain of any of the major electronic things. It can be programmed to control the way buttons, motors, switches, lights and other electronic parts work together. Arduino is hands on which is one of the many reasons it is appealing to kids. The advantages of Arduinos include Arduino based system are used for homeowners to control the lights, thermostates, security system and appliances and it is used for sensors and lights and to check heartbeats and it has enormous applications in biomedical fields such as measuring heartbeat and other medical processes too. Arduino has various pins which can be connected to various electronic components. Arduinos are cheaper when compared to other electronic devices. And the disadvantages in Arduino are the AT Mega 328P processor has only limited memory and low processing power which makes the microcontroller chips to work slow. Arduino UNO boards can process only one task at a time and has a single core process. Arduino UNO boards do not have various connectivity options. It has only single connectivity option so that only one electronic component can be connected at a time. 
The steps that are involved in Arduino programs are while we are doing the program program of Arduino in a computer by connecting the electronic device we should follow the various steps that are used for Arduino programming. First of all Arduino should be download and install the Arduino environment then launch the Arduino if needed install the drivers to connect the board to your computer through the USB cable select your board select your serial port open the blink example upload the program and you will be getting the results while the computer is connected with the Arduino it will measure the requirements that what we need and it will give the result too Arduino is a developing field and which has various developing in the future so Arduino is developed very much well in the future and its limitations can be broken in the future and this is all about my topic and I'm thanking for this opportunity